this is the Disney Twins. It's Marianne here live on location at the Old Key West Disney Vacation Club Resort. And I have to say, we just arrived. We're pretty excited. This is a hidden gem. You know, I think a lot of the times when you're booking your DVC resorts, you want to be on the monorail. So you're at the Contemporary, the Grand Floridian, now the New Polynesian. Uh, they're really popular um, around Epcot. Those Crescent Lake resorts are the Beach Club, um, the Boardwalk as well for DVC Vacation Club members. But I'm here at the, uh, the original gem, which is Old Key West, the first resort opened 25 years ago. Um, so I'm going to do a little tour of our very spacious one bedroom. I have, the rooms are huge here and there are a lot of little um, features that you don't get at some of the newer DVC resorts. So here's my tour of Old Key West. favorite thing about the one bedrooms at Old Key West is there's a full washer dryer, not a stackable. <laughs> Pretty cool, huh? Old Key West is laid out where the villas are separate buildings and then there's a main sort of town center um, as part of the fictional village of Conk Flats, which is where the main pool and the boat dock and check-in and Olivia's restaurant are located. For my money, one of the best hidden gems in all of Disney is Olivia's Restaurant. They have a fantastic to-go menu. Their breakfast is amazing. Try the Crab Cake Eggs Benedict. It's fabulous. We had a huge shrimp po'boy that could have been shared for lunch. You've got to order the conch fritters. 
and both the key lime tart and mascarpone cheesecake are highly recommended. Also when you walk into Olivia's you see pictures of all of the different families that have visited and they encourage you to send your family picture back to the restaurant and they'll post it on the wall. We're here at Olivia's. Hi Jenny. Shrimp po' boy. It's pretty awesome. Definitely worth sharing. The conch fritters, as you can see, will probably be gone soon. Delicious. We love them. There is a lovely 15 to 20 minute boat ride that takes you over to Disney Springs. There's a dock over by Jock Hangers. It's a great boat ride behind Saratoga Springs and past the Treehouse Villas. I totally recommend it as a quick way of getting to Disney Springs from the resort. The main lobby of the hotel takes place in a fictional village called Conk Flats. There's a general store, gurgling suitcase bar, a community center with kids activities, an exercise room if you need to walk off the conch fritters, and there's also goods to go, counter service, and the turtle shack, which are the poolside snacks. Over by the pool, there's a wade pool for kids, an awesome sandcastle water slide, and three smaller pools around the property if you don't want to go to the main hospitality center um, for the pool. Recreational activities include tennis, volleyball, basketball, outdoor campfires and movies, guiding fishing excursions, video games, bikes and surrey rentals, ping pong, shuffleboard, cornhole, an indoor pool table, and bumper pool. That's it for our tour of Disney's Old Key West. I hope you've enjoyed it. I'm gonna lay out by the pool because it's a beautiful day here in Orlando. I'm Marianne of the Disney Twins. Thanks for joining me and see you next time.